If you're reading this... Go write three sentences on your current writing project. No! The feminine desire to be a man. The masculine desire to be a woman. The non-binary desire to be asleep. Hawaiian shirt covered in blood, it is a look. Vampire on vacation? Assassin whose target has led them to a tropical resort trying to blend in? Guy who's just having a really weird day? It vibes whichever way. Sitcom where people get gradually killed off in their spot and the opening title theme is replaced with dead silence. I'd like to question your definition of sitcom. I want this for friends. Except it's just Ross. Ross is gone. You just, you know, do the friend sequence. All of Ross's space. Gone. Just gone. No homo. Well, why the hell not? Take the day off from being the bigger person and choose violence. You deserve it. Attention, bisexuals. I am authorizing use of the plasma beam. <laughs> what, what does that mean? Andy, you have any clue what that means? People who are nice to me in online games, even though I suck, I owe you my life. People who communicate in online games by jumping around or spinning a circle instead of using the chat function. I love you. Be communication. Just like bees. I saw Venom 2 in Taiwan a few days ago, and when Venom said good evening to Mrs. Chen in Mandarin, all the little old ladies in my theater collectively let out an impressed, ooh. Got a lot of Mrs. Chen's in the audience, I see. I would like to talk more about how there was a crowd of little old ladies at the showing of Venom 2, Let There Be Carnage. All articles about Tumblr's decline boil down to two things. You can't get famous on there, and you can't make money on there. And they don't get that's why we like it here. Oh, contraire. You can absolutely get famous there. It is, however, inexplicably a bad thing. Actually, Tumblr's declined from what I've been told by thousands upon thousands of comments. They took away NSFW posts because of some bot thing. And little do those people know, that shit didn't actually fucking work. Please remember that I am a Canadian illustrator, and it is fucking bizarre to come to me with medical questions. Why would you limit yourself to drawing Canadians? Everyone else, unfollow me. I want to be alone with Arsenal. If I do end up owning One Direction, I would set them free. Mabel Pines. Winner! But guys, what if... What if the reason we get so attached to fictional characters is because they were supposed to be our soulmates, but we were born in different universes? Why would you do this? I only have four moods. Fuck this, fuck that, fuck me, and fuck you! I empathize with the above, but I have an additional four moods to add. Fuck yeah, fuck no, Fuck my life. Fuck everything. And don't forget the inevitable fuck it. And for those who have just given up, fuck. This is beautiful. Oh shit, I just noticed a blood moon tonight. Who pissed off Sienna? I warned y'all. I warned y'all about commenting on a figure. And now, it's go time. Andy, drop the fucking moon on him. Let's go.